I'm sick and tired and fed up, aren't you? I'm sick and tired of being screwed every time I turn around. I'm sick and tired of being ruled by the liberal and conservative elite. I'm sick and tired of being dependent on the elite through big government and big business. I'm sick and tired of politicians on the left and right not giving a damn about me and the hell I go through every day. I'm sick and tired of not having a true democracy in the United States. I'm sick and tired of having no political representation at the local, state, or federal levels. I'm sick and tired of having no effective means of removing criminals, liars, profiteers, and usurpers from government and business. I'm sick and tired of living in poverty, having no protection from criminal landlords, and being denied access to medical care, legal representation, courts, and public transportation. I hope you heard that. I'm being denied my right to public transportation, and I have no other means of getting around. I'm sick and tired of the insecurity of the constant threat of having what little I have taken from me at any time. I'm sick and tired of having no say in the social policies or conditions that affect my life. I'm sick and tired of my problems and complaints being ignored. I'm sick and tired of having my rights constantly violated by those who've sworn to protect my rights. I'm sick and tired of corrupt cops. I'm sick and tired of cops not enforcing the law and denying me my right to file criminal complaints. My last landlord extorted 50 grand from me and my family, and the cops denied me my right to even file a complaint. They've done this several times. I'm sick and tired of my current landlord and the cops refusing to protect me from abusive neighbors who've attacked me with loud music for the last 10 months. I'm sick and tired of having no legal recourse to protect myself from those who prey on me. I'm sick and tired of those sworn to protect me, threatening me if I try to protect myself from those who prey on me. I'm sick and tired of being physically ill every day and being denied medical care, although I'm fully covered by Medicare. I'm sick and tired of doctors committing Medicare fraud and getting away with it even when it's reported. I'm sick and tired of the pharmaceutical industry pushing unnecessary and harmful drugs onto kids and adults alike. And I'm sick and tired of pharmaceutical companies charging extortion prices for the drugs that are effective and can help people. I'm sick and tired of capitalism. I'm sick and tired of justice and the pursuit of justice being for sale. I'm sick and tired of business and government secrecy and corruption. I'm sick and tired of oil and industrial pollution and environmental exploitation. I'm sick and tired of Walmart and Amazon, worker exploitation, child labor, sweatshops, and factory farming. I'm sick and tired of materialism and commercialism. I'm sick and tired of paying for the internet and its commercials. I'm sick and tired of governmental responsibilities being privatized. I'm sick and tired of contractual, forced arbitration, and all the other violations of the Bill of Rights. I'm sick and tired of pot being illegal and the overtaxation of tobacco. I'm sick and tired of the legal blacklisting called credit reports, which can be full of falsehoods and slander, yet they are now used to deny people employment and rental housing. I'm sick and tired of paying 40 years of rent, not missing even one payment, but not having anything to show for it. I should have owned a home by now, but not under capitalism. 
I'm sick and tired of insane property values, unfettered inflation, and extortion economics. I'm sick and tired of wage slavery and debt slavery and the ridiculous costs of medical care and education. I'm sick and tired of the Department of Education enforcing the student loan scam. This scam has stolen over $9,000 for my disability for a $3,500 debt I don't owe. I don't owe it because the university violated its contract, committed fraud and attempted extortion, and I didn't even finish the semester and I received no college credits. But profiteers, politicians in the Department of Education don't care about any of that. They don't care if I received a benefit at all. All they care about is making me pay, keeping me in debt in the perpetual misappropriation of my disability payments. I'm sick and tired of people who enforce the will of the elite, who follow their orders and prey on others for the benefit of the elite and call it employment. I'm sick and tired of people being apathetic of the everyday crimes they commit the fraud, profiteering, extortion, and denial of basic human rights these employees commit against their fellow citizens upon the command of their employers. I'm sick and tired of an educational system that doesn't teach basic principles of law, human rights, empathy, and self-respect as required components of the fundamentals of education. I'm sick and tired of doublespeak and newspeak being used by the left and right. I'm sick and tired of fascists denying their fascism. I'm sick and tired of alt and neo being added to every word imaginable. I'm sick and tired of being told the biology of gender is a falsehood and gender is a choice. Gender roles can be chosen, but your gender is biologically determined and can't in reality be changed. I'm sick and tired of those suffering from the mental illness of gender dysphoria being exploited and manipulated by profiteering surgical butchers, hormone pushers, and an elite that's lost all touch with reality. Gender dysphoria sufferers need treatment and our respect. They need the respect of being told the truth about their mental illness not the special privilege to force, by law, all of society to deny biological reality and scientific facts and reinforce their delusions. I'm sick and tired of illegal immigrants being exploited by the left and right. One side uses racism to denounce illegal immigration, and the other side claims everyone against illegal immigration are racist. They're both wrong. I'm sick and tired of unrestricted immigration and the rise of bigotry and fascism it causes. I'm sick and tired of illegal immigrants being abused by human traffickers. I'm sick and tired of illegals negative effect on American labor rights and illegals being given public assistance and educations denied legal American citizens. I'm sick and tired of sanctuary cities and free access to legal representation being offered to these illegals while the numbers of American poor and homeless continue to skyrocket and they continue to be refused sanctuary and legal representation. I'm sick and tired of the elite using the issues of illegal immigration to divide us and people being stupid enough to let it divide us. I'm sick and tired of idiots running around shooting people, of misogyny, sexual harassment, rape, child molestation, and racism from whites and blacks. I'm sick and tired of whites and blacks saying nigger and people using the word bitch as if they're socially acceptable. They aren't. 
I'm sick and tired of disrespect and self-hate. I'm sick and tired of bullies still being a problem everywhere. I'm sick and tired of gangsterism, tattoos, and body mutilation being promoted by pop culture. I'm sick and tired of celebrity emulation, blind conformity, mass manipulation, and entertainment addiction. I'm sick and tired of violence, torture, and murder inundating our entertainment. I'm sick and tired of exposing children to sexually explicit material through the internet and the music industry. I'm sick and tired of direct marketing to minors. I'm sick and tired of parents who've forgotten how to say no. I'm sick and tired of the depraved and demented promoters of greed and stupidity dictating social norms and cultural trends. I'm sick and tired of people defending this crap. I'm sick and tired of fascists ruling the world, of nationalism, militarism, perpetual war, overflowing prisons, and cops being militarized and given license to harass, intimidate, beat, and kill unarmed citizens. I'm sick and tired of being ruled by elite fascist abstractions that do me harm. I'm sick and tired of fascist industrialists and fascist scientists and fascist engineers dictating the direction of humanity, genetically modifying foods, the cashless economy, the surveillance society, transhumanism, and the implementation of the police state. I'm sick and tired of being searched every time I enter a public building or exit a retail store. I'm sick and tired of the elite trying to disarm us while militarizing the police. I'm sick and tired of nuclear energy, nuclear waste, and nuclear weapons. I'm sick and tired of the elitist lies and false promises of change. I'm sick and tired of the elite who keep us divided by spewing the same lies over and over and the idiots falling for it generation after generation. I'm sick and tired of slaves accepting their own slavery. I'm sick and tired of middle class apathy while the middle class itself becomes poorer and more exploited every day. I'm sick and tired of the elite preying on everyone and the poor preying on the poor. I'm sick and tired of people claiming to admire Jesus, John Locke, Thomas Paine, Henry David Thoreau, Gandhi, Martin Luther King, John Lennon, and George Carlin, yet refusing to actually listen to them or follow their example. I'm sick and tired of the hypocrites who complain but refuse to take the action needed so we can all be protected from those who prey on us every day. I'm sick and tired of those on the left and right who persistently demonstrate the insanity of doing the same thing over and over but expecting different results. I'm sick and tired of over-intellectualizing and the people who continue to believe solutions are complicated. They aren't. I'm sick and tired of hero worship and celebrity cults. I'm sick and tired of morons who continually turn to the rich to resolve their problems that are caused by the rich. I'm sick and tired of people searching for and turning to wealthy heroes be they business, political, or intellectual heroes, as the saviors of humanity. I'm sick and tired of those who haven't figured out they, in their actions, are the key to justice in a better world. I'm sick and tired of those on the left and right who continue to play the game, but continue to complain yet refuse to change their own lives and stop participating in the very system they claim to despise. I'm sick and tired of a society that functions only to my detriment or doesn't function at all. I'm sick and tired of a society that protects the criminals and victimizes their victims 
that protects the predators and not the prey. I'm sick and tired of whistleblowers and others who demonstrate high ethics being slandered and punished. I'm sick and tired of contracts and promises being routinely broken. A society where lying, deceit, and fraud is practiced by almost everyone and is culturally promoted and excused. I'm sick and tired of people rationalizing their own deceit, predation, and corruption. I'm sick and tired of people rationalizing their own apathy and inaction. I'm sick and tired of being betrayed and screwed every day. I'm sick and tired of the insanity of the world. I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. Aren't you? I'm fed up. Aren't you? My patience is at an end. Isn't yours? What the hell is it going to take to get you people to act? To act in your own self-interest? To act in protecting your future, in the future of freedom and security of your own families. My videos are not entertainment. They are straight information with no sugar coating. All of these issues I just listed were created and are perpetuated by the elite to keep us following mindless, costly trends, to keep us enslaved brainwashed, distracted, divided, and stupefied to keep us fighting each other so the elite can maintain their power over us and continue their control over the planet. They don't want us getting along. They want us to be suspicious and distrustful of each other. They want us to fear one another. Can't you see that? One sign of insanity is to keep doing the same things over and over and expecting different results. Those on the left and right exhibit this insanity. But equalism refuses to repeat the mistakes of the past. I founded a philosophy called equalism and it's for anyone who's damn sick and tired of their own exploitation and manipulation by their respective elitist leadership. The elite on both sides just keep offering the same old crap ad nauseum and nothing ever changes. So here's the reality. Humanity has two choices. Keep doing what it's been doing for over 5,000 years and let the elite who divide us continue to enslave us or do something different for once. Equalism is something different. I adapted to equalism. Equalism wasn't adapted to me. It's based upon reality in the common sense and practical positions of both sides while exposing and denouncing the fascism on both sides. Fascists want to dominate, and equalists don't. Fascists are predators, and non-predators are equalists. And the non-predators on the left and right must unite. And they can unite through their mutual respect and protection of each other's right to make their own decisions about their lives and choose their own paths. The equalists on the left and right can unite for the common good. The equalist among the middle class must also unite with themselves and the poor. Simply stop identifying with your elitist fascist oppressors and start identifying with each other. The middle class and the poor have much more in common with each other than either have in common with the elite. The solutions really are simple. Constructive change can be achieved peacefully with a minimum of confrontation or social disruption. Just stop allowing the elite to define your enemies and define you. And stop your own participation in this fascist system that does you harm and forces you to harm others. Be the change you want in the world. 
Equalism also offers a plan of direct action called the Bread Revolution. So if you want to actually change the world for the better and protect your own self-interest, why not try something different rather than the same old failed liberal or conservative mistakes of the past? Watch my Equalism video lecture series in sequence starting with Equalism 101 to learn more about Equalism. It's a new and unique approach. Join the Equalism Revolution and let's end this 5,000 year old cycle of elitist fascist oppression. Thanks.